Two men, meantime, back here are facing charges this morning over alleged threats to the Jewish community. Police say they were armed and planned to attack synagogues in the city. CBS 2's Christy Collegian reports live from Lower Manhattan, where the suspects are expected to be arraigned later today. Christy? Good morning, Andrea. Those involved are saying we avoided a situation that could have turned out like the Tree of Life uh, synagogue in Pittsburgh, as well as that Tops shooting um, here also in New York. But uh, we have a 21-year-old and a 22-year-old facing charges um, of criminal possession of a weapon, aggravated assault, as well as uh, making terroristic threats. And it was a joint effort with law enforcement and local organizations in tracking these two down. This rise in anti-Semitism does not seem to be going away. It continues to rise. The Jewish community continues to be on high alert, although a major threat was stopped in its tracks at Penn Station on Saturday night. Police arrested 21-year-old Christopher Brown from Long Island and 22-year-old Matthew Marrer from Manhattan. Brown has a known history of mental illness. Police say they recovered several items, including a large hunting knife, an illegal Glock 17 firearm, and a 30-round magazine. We have a couple of very talented threat intelligence analysts who are in, for lack of a better term, the sort of sewers of the internet. Mitchell Silbers with Community Security Initiative, one of the organizations that tracked down Marrer and Brown. They combed through online forums and found their threats to unspecified New York synagogues. This is one of those situations where, you know, you only have some pieces of the puzzle, so you do the best you can. We ultimately found out that he was in Long Island. We thought he was coming into New York, but, you know, no one really knew where or what his target was. Sources say Brown was found wearing a swastika armband. Roz Rothenstein with education organization Stand With Us has a message for the two young men awaiting arraignment. Take a breath. Take a trip to the Holocaust Museum. Learn about the history of the Jewish people and how they've been targeted and harmed. And, uh, you know, go to therapy for God's sake. And Andrea, this follows threats that were made earlier this month to New Jersey synagogues in Lower Manhattan. Christy Kalishian, CBS 2 News. Christy, thank you.